Uh, my name is Dickens Magumia, and I'm from a small town in Uganda called Kampala. I guess in Uganda, it's a lot different here in the US because here you have the public school system and a majority of the students go there and they get a really good education. In Uganda, the public education is really not the best. So if you want to study for free, you're not going to have a really good quality of education. So at the age of about 13 is when you get to go to high school and parents usually find it better to take you to a boarding school. And so during that time, it was mainly my dad that was supporting the whole family. For him, seeing a person getting a good education was something that I knew would be valuable. At some point, I guess I was really not sure what I wanted to do. I asked God to reveal to me in a dream what he wanted me to be in the future. And that night I was really scared because I was like, what if he reveals to me that I should be a plumber or a carpenter or something like that, something I didn't really want to do. But then in my dream, I saw an aircraft or something like a spacecraft. It was a flying body. When I applied to universities, I considered OU because I had friends that had applied to OU before. And when I was doing research about OU, I discovered they had aerospace engineering, and so this would be a stepping stone for me. So a step towards me actually becoming an aerospace engineer, something that I know I wouldn't be able to achieve by staying in the country. There's a lot of opportunities for aerospace engineers here at OU, and also, I think it was about 11 of us that were selected to go on this student enrichment program in Houston and Dallas. And we were able to visit a lot of companies. So the goal was to network. So we get to meet a lot of all your alumni that have been successful in life and get to hear from them. So pick their brains, get to know some of the tips to succeed in life. I got to see a lot of this technology. It was really eye-opening because it made me feel like Oh, wow, these are the things I'm going to be working with when I graduate, and I'm really looking forward to it. I feel like by doing the things that I love, making aircraft or helping to make um, air transportation easier or make it a more efficient means of transportation, I'll be helping a lot of people in the future. And even though there's like a lot of students here at OU, I mean, there's over 30,000. It still isn't hard for you to establish your own group of friends or come up with a bunch of people that you will connect with. It's a good thing that we have a lot of people because, I mean, you have a variety. There's a lot of people out there that are interested in, in finding out about you and why you do the things that you do and what, what inspires you.